Big AI labs know that the secrets of a powerful successful model is scaling the size of the model or scaling the time it takes to do the inference with the model. But that takes a lot of money, a lot of time, a lot of resources. That is where this new research model from Alibaba's Quen tries to make a difference. I think that this could be huge for especially the users who want to run large language models locally. This is Fahad Mirza and I welcome you to the channel. Let me try to explain first what I meant by this scaling laws for the models and then we will talk about the users who want to run these models locally. The parallel scaling law or Power scale introduces a new paradigm for scaling large language models by utilizing parallel computation during both training and inference. In very simple words, what it means is that if you want to improve the performance of a large language model, you either give it more parameters or you throw more resources on it. The more time, the more resources you provide, the more better the model performs. Now, what this pair scale or parallel scaling law is trying to do, it is trying to offer an alternative to traditional methods like increasing model parameters. Not only that, by accompanying their research, they also have released a lot of checkpoints of these scaled models and we are going to install one of them locally and we will play around with it a bit to see how exactly it performs, but I believe the most important part of this video is where you understand that what they have done, they have actually produced a new method of scaling, which is really cool. If you want to delve more deeply into the mathematics and nitty gritty of this, you can go through their GitHub repo and I will drop the link to it in video description. But very quickly, the method follows a logarithmic scaling law. So what it does is, by increasing the number of parallel streams p they can yield performance improvements similar to increasing model parameters by o this is especially valuable for models where adding more parameters becomes inefficient pair scale also offers universal applicability it works with any model architecture it can perform particularly well on reasoning tasks like math and coding and allows dynamic adaptation at inference time. So you can even adjust computational effort on the fly. And that is where you can read through and check out various checkpoints which they have shared. But now let's get it installed and I will talk more about the local LLM users and how that benefits them. I'm going to start the installation while we talk. So this is my Ubuntu system. This is my GPU card, NVIDIA RTX A6000 with 48 GB of VRAM. I'm creating a virtual environment. If you also want to test out, then you can get the GPU on rent from Mast Compute on a very, very affordable price. I will drop the link to their website in video's description. I'm also going to give you a discount coupon code of 50% for a range of GPU so please do check them out okay so while my virtual environment gets created okay it's already done so I'll just start by installing all the prerequisites and then I'm launching my Jupyter notebook while that happens let's talk a bit more about the local LLM users so look I think for such users it is a major breakthrough because most consumer GPUs are memory bandwidth bound during single user inference leaving much of their compute power unused. Pair scale takes advantage of this spare compute capacity by running multiple inferences in parallel and combining them to simulate a batch size of one. Effectively, boosting model capability without significantly increasing latency. There are a lot of other alternatives like mixture of expert, but I think this one, pair scale has a much, much lower memory footprint as it only needs to store lightweight transformations rather than multiple experts model so that is uh, i believe quite groundbreaking so we will also get it installed and we will check it out meanwhile it installs that prerequisite let me also introduce you to the sponsors of the video who are camel ai camel is an open source community focused on building multi-agent infrastructures for finding the scaling laws with applications in data generation 
task automation and world simulation and i will drop the link in videos description okay so let's first download our model and as i said there are a lot of checkpoints but i'm just going to go with instruction two in one as you can see with instruct at the end and in 1.8 billion parameter size and these are the fine tunes of coin 2.5 i believe and the model is getting downloaded shouldn't take too long and the model is downloaded let's try to do the inference as i said earlier these models are mainly geared towards logical mathematics and uh, reasoning task but let's start with the language one so i'm asking it what is happiness okay sorry i didn't give it the proper word so there was a typo here let's run it again let's wait for it and maybe we will also check the vram consumption so it is consuming close to 8 gig of vram okay so that is good so let's go down and check what it did and yep if you look uh, read through the answer it is pretty good i haven't formatted the output so that is fine but if you go through this the language looks good the quality of con 2.5 oozes through and answer is quite good very succinct very very targeted okay but let's try to uh, do maybe a logical deduction uh, question and then we will see how it goes so what i'm going to ask here is that if all bloops are ranks and all ranks are lawns are all bloops necessarily lawns explain why or why not this should be fun let's see okay what it did here let me scroll down let me format it properly okay so i have adjusted the hyperparameters to avoid repetition and all that stuff so let's run it again and there you go this time the response looks quite good there you go so answer is correct yes these are necessarily loans and then it has done its transitive reasoning as you can see here very good answer and now next up i am asking it a math question so the question is that you have a rope that burns completely in 60 minutes however the rope does not burn at a uniform rate and then i'm asking it to how can you measure exactly 45 minutes using only the two ropes and the match so let's run this and again a correct answer and brilliantly explained i would say in terms of a very short quick reasoning so it says that it to exactly measure this follow these steps spot on so look i think reasoning logic math all look good finally let's also test out a quick coding question which is not that easy but still i think that should tell us um, the quality or not the quality of this model in terms of coding so i'm asking it to write me a python function reverse string that takes a string as input and returns the reversed version of it without using python slicing or the built-in reverse function let's check it out and there you go it has given us a response and the function is correct even it has given us a example usage but there is no preamble or any synopsis of the code but that is fine i think as long as the code is good let them just remember the model size so that's it still i believe that this parallel scaling is something which we will see in a lot of future models especially the bigger ones and then i think this might be either act as alternative of mixture of expert or we might see some combined or fu fusion architecture there let me know what do you think if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel if you're already subscribed please share it among your network as it helps thank you for watching